same setup. From right here. Mm -hmm. Here, it's just like an almost like a dilla position, okay? Some people, like the Chinese in the Olympics, they really sit high up. Mm -hmm. People, they're over. Asian you know, squat, huh? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you want to keep the the whole time. You want to keep this this power motion until you're ready to over, to extend. So that way you can have a good angle on it. Okay. So all of this is from right here. You're gonna pull up as soon as you clear the knees. Okay. Mm -hmm. You're gonna activate your lower back. Okay. Uh, activating the lower back. All you is just straight up. So you're tightening the lower back straight. Right. Okay. So from here, up pull the knee. Okay. From here, extend, shrug, drop one leg. Okay, it's kind of really hard. They call it a double knee bend. I still, to this day, myself, I don't know how the hell it's a double knee bend. Okay. Okay, but it, there's two knee bends in the movement. So the first one is right here. Come up, and I guess this is considered as no longer knee bend, and then boom, this is double knee bend. So what happened is, mm. you Popping explode up. from right here. Okay, a lot of people when they explode, Very slow. And you're pulling it up, it's very slow. And as soon as you activate this, it's this motion right here. That's good for lower back. You're gonna fully extend, shrug, do the scarecrow movement. And if you're gonna do a regular clean or pop a squat, you can catch it right here. Or you can do a squat clean and drop under and catch it. Hmm. And that's all it is. Um, it's a lot easier with weights on. Because right now the bar, I, I kind of feel like I'm doing it wrong. I'm going to come out. I feel like you're going to fly off into the... Just kind of like with the PVC pipe. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, 